And when you start plotting, and Henry's hit, he the oh, good game, baby. Combo. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Thank goodness for heaters up here. And thank goodness I don't have to carry the football in this game. Anywhere. It's cold out there, trying to clutch the football and absorb that the was hits. Me too, that Not easily me. done. Yeah, we saw a product of the elements they're right there. They're going to review. They're going to review. Ah. Oh, no, no. That's, that's, he's down. He's down. The Titans offense set to begin the drive. And last time, not only the turnover, but that turned into six points. They got to make up for that here. You always hear about empty possessions. So I'm get a hit thing, so you can have an empty possession, pump the ball away, get yourself set to play defense. But when you turn it over, it changes momentum. And when they take it downfield and bunch it in on you, that's a bad possession all the way around. You're hungry to get back out there, aren't you? You better be, because otherwise, it's going to be a long day for you. And he'll be stuck right one. at midfield. Man. 17 yards on that play for the Dang, Titans. They don't even have well, um, for a few Ryan years there, We thought this read option play was going to he take over the whole NFL. That. It seemed like everyone was using it. But it has been scaled back considerably in the last few seasons, mainly because people are worried about their quarterbacks getting hit. But when you call it at the right time and you use it properly, you see the type of gains you can get. A nice chunk of yardage there by the quarterback. Why are you standing there, Earl Thomas? Pretty good result. That's how you know you're a charge defender, man. As he takes this forward for about six. It's a six-yard pickup, but it gets him to six. You got four X factors in this team. Come on. Yeah. They'll run the jet sweep and yes, Brown. AJ and Brown. Swallowed up right at the line of scrimmage. No gain on the play five, that time, and they look four. to convert on what'll be a third and four. And it looks like we've got a dime set here defensively. Six DBs in the game. To throw is Edwards. From the gun, he'll throw. I like this. He's going to be sacked. They sack it back right at the midfield stripe. Jalen Ferguson in there to drop it for a six-yard loss, and that will lead to fourth down. Is Kern the punter to send this one away? This is fielded at the seven. Call it an even 40 yard punt. The Raven offense set at the line for this next drive. The last possession, these guys were able to tie the game with a touchdown, and now they'll have a chance to move out in front. Yeah, let's give a big assist to the defense. Got and that's caught inside the 35. And Touchdown. Oh, baby. Marquise 86 yards. <laughs> Take it ah. And the Ravens have taken the lead. He was wide open. He, he, he outran his um, it's been a then the start safety to team. This quarter, you noted. Yeah, and we got that. that lead that we're seeing, I looked in the they mud because it's raining. I get the sense this one's going to go back and forth all game long. And that probably won't be the last Too long touchdown that we see in this one. See, that's how good we have to play. That's how safe we have to play. We can't be good. And that makes the score 14 to 7. Please. This is playoff. The offensive coordinators Mark dream about. Sir. One play drives from that distance. What an effort. It results in the touchdown. I don't want this win. And this will be a touchback as that sails over the end line. The Titan offense now working their way back onto the field. They've been a come from behind team all year. They'll need to do it again as they trail early in this wild card game. And he's got some space here. He's able to rip off 32 on that one. It's a first down. Well, they came into this game saying hey, it was important that they set the tone and show that they can run the football. I believe that they've done that here in the first quarter. So the big play gets him across midfield now for first and ten. They try to run on first down, but this defense says no dice. They stop him a couple yards behind the line of scrimmage. That didn't appear to be a run blitz. He just darted in once he saw the run develop. That appeared to be a case of see ball, get ball. To throw on second down. Edwards. And that'll be incomplete. Pretty good shot as he tried to pull that one in. 
Couldn't hang on third down. An incomplete pass on that last play, and that means he'll need to come up with something here on third down. Edwards operating from the gun. He finds Humphreys. He's going to go out of bounds, but he takes this one down just shy of the 20. There is no way. And why did I swat it? I tried to, I, I did the pick button. See, that should be a pig, not no swat. Closer to the line of scrimmage amidst traffic. But in this case, how about the free safety coming up and making the big time play? Now throwing on third down there, but he can't connect. Good D. Good. Good job there creating Let the him know. Towards the incompletion. And now since it's fourth yes, down, that should set up a field goal situation. And a nice sigh of relief defensively to be able to hold them to three. Tavecchio puts this one through. And they'll cut the lead back down to four now at 14-10. So the drive stalls out inside the 15-yard line, but they do get three. And I've talked with enough players nowadays that when they have these types of kicks, that no one says to their guy, hey, that's just like making an extra point, piece of cake. Because the extra point is not a piece of cake anymore. <laughs> but kicking a field goal from that distance, just give him confidence and let him knock it through. Lamar Jackson marching back onto the field. He's thrown for a touchdown pass, and he's run for one so far. When you're able to watch a guy perform at a high level and do it in multiple ways, yeah, arm, legs, he really helps his team in a big way. You've got to think that they feel great about where they are in this ball game, and they feel even better about him leading their team. Now he's hoping to put them into a better spot after this drive. Second and 12. Jackson. You can outrun him. You can outrun him. This is uh, the 20. It's a big play. I didn't even have to go to him. And even 60 yards. Could have been a game meeting. All they talked about was keeping him hemmed in and wanting him to catch. make his throws from the pocket because they knew he was pretty dangerous if he got outside. And he just showed it right there. Pretty good arm, too. And he'll get this down only to the 18. Give him maybe a yard, quite the opposite from the previous big gainer. A one-yard gain can look like a disaster, but it all depends on how the game is going. With a series of one-yard gains running the ball, if that's the case, you might have to start thinking about throwing it a little bit more. But if it's just the occasional one-yard run, hey, congratulations to the defense. They won that one. Come back again the next time. Second catch of this wild card game, and it goes for a first down. Throwing is Jackson. That was an accident, I swear. That's going to wind up incomplete. He was looking for his tight end, Mark Andrews, there, but it'll be second and goal. They'll go again from the three here on second and goal. Up, man. Here's Jackson to throw. Flush to his right. He's going to take off with it. And that is caught. But that was a nasty judge catch. Right there to say incomplete. Pass. So he was past the line of scrimmage when he threw it. And as they say, that's a no-no. Got to be able to understand where you are on the field and not cross the line. That was an accident, though. Field. I pressed the wrong button. Third and goal, 
Jackson. Flushed out right. He may try and run for this. And they'll get him down about three yards short of the first. They'll wind up getting four I'll yards go for down on his own, but it also brings up fourth down. I liked his effort there. He got it done on his own. But let's face it, he puts defenses in a really stressful spot. Don't worry about it. I can get this. Because a lot of guys have coverage responsibilities. Good job of rounding, though, because I thought when he first took off, he might pick up the first down. Try and throw for it with Jackson, eluding the pressure right. And he's going to go down even just outside of the five, right around the six yard line. Harold Sorry. Landry and the Titans Sorry. defense will celebrate the goal line stand. A breakdown by the O line at the worst possible time. Fourth and goal, and it leads to a sack. And I can just see it now. But on the sidelines, they're telling the quarter, you've got to get rid of it somehow, some way. At least get it in the end zone and give us a chance. If we throw an interception, so what? A sack? We didn't even have a chance. And a short gain here across the 10 to the 12. Three yards on the pickup. That's going to set up an interesting third and about four to go. Here's Edwards from the gun on third down. And it's complete. Henry. And he's going to get the first down here as he's taken down at the 22. They get nine out of that one, and as a result, the drive continues. Edwards now on first down. It's caught by Davis. A gain of six there on first. Six yards was the pickup on the last completion, so here's second and four. They'll run with him. He's like a freight train. And he gets this one just shy of the 40. They'll mark him down at the 39. An 11-yard pickup for the Titans and a first down. So from the 39 now, they'll come up on a first and 10. Now Edwards. Ball play action. This one caught by Davis. I didn't even see and him, And taking man. it across midfield and inside the 45. Another nice gain. That's now 30 yards between those last two plays. So in Raven territory now. Here's a first and 10 at the 43. And to give this time to the tailback. And the result here, a pickup of eight. Leaves him with two to go on second down. Eight yards the tally on that first down run. Here's second and two. They'll get that one out quickly to Brown. And he'll work it inside the 30 to the 29-yard line. They'll run on first down. It's Henry. And only able to muster a couple down to about the 27. Earlier this half, you were wondering how they were going to defend him. I think you used the term bottle him up at different levels. They've struggled to do that. They certainly have because when you see them approach, in order to bottle him up at different levels, that front line's got to take care of business. Otherwise, he starts to sit through. Here's second and eight. Got a man. It's Brown. Four yards on the completion, and it sets up a third down. People worry about throwing the out route because often it can get jumped, and that can turn to an either an incompletion or an interception. But not on that one. Everything came together, and he catches it and goes over the sideline. Looking to throw. Edwards. And that's caught by Smith. And he's going to have a first down here as he gets this one to the 17 yard line. That good for six as they keep this drive right on rolling. Back to throw. Edwards. Fumble, thank you. Now the ball comes loose. That's impossible, bro. And the defense not able to get it. But from a defensive perspective, what's that moment like when you realize the ball is loose? It is a moment where all concentration goes right to the football. This is something you've talked about in all your preparation for the game. And you probably talk about this training camp. Knock the ball free, take it away from the other team, and now you have that chance. There's <laughs> a little bit of deflation when they end up recovering it. They knocked it free, but couldn't take it away. So it's first and goal and a great opportunity to, to get that lead back before the break. Looking to throw. Edwards. This is caught. And he'll be brought down right on the edge of the goal line at about the one yard line. They have. Now Tennessee going to use the second of their timeouts. 
As the clock will stop with 55 seconds to go until halftime. Second and goal from the one. Now a second down throw for the end zone, but it's incomplete. Well, he's been looking at quite a bit on this drive, and finally I think the guys on the defensive side, they said no more. They saw the double coverage on him. It made it very tough for him to get the ball. Hey, Mama. Touchdown, Tennessee. AJ Brown. How? There to make the grab. And the Titans are going to retake the lead. I'll let you do the analysis. How do you catch that? Touchdown pass as young quarterback throws and with the success that his team has had, I just continue to be more and more impressed. Let's both do the analysis. Impressed. Aren't we both? Yeah. I mean, and why shouldn't we be? We've seen him improve throughout the year. We've seen him settle in now, and you can see the confidence of the team has they grown. His confidence has grown. Good. I think that everyone around this guy feels good about what they've seen. And it's also seen for him when he's driving home to turn on Sports Talk Radio. He's okay. They had to go to the monitor, get an extra look. That's what the technology is for. And this touchdown will count. Tavecchio good on the extra point. And it's now 17-14. And what a drive that was. 16 plays all told. And it ends with a Tennessee score. This is taken at the three. And he'll take it up past the 25 to the 26-yard line. The Baltimore offense at the line set to get going. Down three under a minute to go. How aggressive are you going to be in this spot? Not as aggressive as I probably would want to be. Only down three. I mean, might as well be even going into the half. That's not a deficit that makes me want to push it and potentially make a mistake in this situation and cost myself even more points. But boy, getting in a field goal range and tying it, that's tempting. Awfully enticing. You almost talked me into it. Being chased out left. He's got the first down here inside the 30. And finally, wrestled down at the 11. The Raiders are going to use the second of their timeouts as it comes with 22 seconds to go here in half number one. Now Jackson steps away to his left. This is like a touchdown. Seconds the to the touchdown line, baby. Woo! And that touchdown does not give them 30 seconds to the touchdown lead. line, baby. Woo! It's still a lead, Under a minute. That always feels good to me. That's how you play football. That's how you beat Tennessee. We got a good kicker in Justin Tucker. Come on. And the Titans are going to recover the football. The second quarter on that kick there that failed. Is that something that maybe they had dialed up before this game started? It feels like it, doesn't it? That they thought they had the right situation, you know, and, and the right approach in going after it. Also may signal that they feel like they have the superior team. That they can try these sorts of things and it will come back and hurt them later. And this they offense is going to elect to burn a they timeout with five that seconds if remaining they try to kick in quarter number two. So on second down, the field goal no, unit is on here as they try to get three before half. This officially a 55-yard attempt. And this is off target to the left. Didn't get there anyway. It's no good. So and we get ball back. Let's go. There you have it. Halftime quickly over. Third quarter. Here we Let's go. go. Both teams try to avoid being one and done in these playoffs as we start the second half of this AFC wild card game. This is taken at the three. And he's up across the 25 and down at the 28-yard line. Boy, he's the way Lamar Jackson's going to be passing to him. Playoffs. Out come the Ravens now. They'll go on offense first here in this third quarter. They have the lead now. They'll be looking to extend that lead. And this is where I enjoy talking about one of my favorite subjects. Tendency breakers, or counters as I also like to call them. You've done things in a certain way in the first half. And they've had ability to see what you've done 
they're going to make their adjustments. So guess what? You adjust yourself and try and stay ahead of the pace because you are looking for some separation in this ball game. The adjustment to the adjustment. Without a doubt. <laughs> show them one thing, hit them with something else. Now a throw oh, to the end zone on first down, but it winds. What? Incomplete. Look at that. That's a catch. Oh, that's Moss. Please. Oh, man. Up incomplete. An incomplete pass on first down. That leads to a second and ten. Here's Jackson throwing again. Forced out to his left. Dang. That is incomplete. A oh, lot of force bearing down on him there. He could not hang on. It's third down. Big play coming up. Here's third and ten. I would expect to see some pressure here. The pressure drops off as they'll look to throw. And now offensively it's third and ten. And I'm just thinking to myself, actors always say, oh, what's me, my motivation? I'm trying to hit the green. I am right not watching. The play caller's thinking, what have I done before? This worked well that I can go to right now. Yeah, because they were pretty successful in the first half scoring points. Oh, Haven't done no. anything so far here in the second half. Yeah, <laughs> Throwing now, Jackson on first down. Dancing to his left. And yeah, he's going to keep it here. The coverage may be too good that time as he breaks away for 19 with his legs and a first down. Two big plays in succession. Not sure this D knows what hit him, but now they got to get ready. It's first and goal. Jackson now. To the goal line, but it's incomplete. And that's what he's got to be happy to have back. There wasn't a hole open in the zone. You'd have to think on early downs like that first down there. Need to be a little bit more careful. Yeah, fortunately for him, got a couple more downs to play with. Second down and goal. Jackson escaping the pressure right. And he'll be brought Damn. down right on the edge of the goal line at about the one-yard line. He turned that into a nice game. Gets him eight yards closer for third down. Well, they've been so good on third down all day long. Can they convert another here on third and goal? Now it's Jackson. Flush to his right. And he's going to go down. This will count as a sack, a very short sack. Taken down at the two. Harold Landry able to get him down behind the line of scrimmage, and it will be fourth down. Third and goal, they decided to throw for it, but how about the play defensively? Couldn't find anyone open. Left him nowhere to go with the football. Had to absorb the sack. Bruh. And that one, my goodness, that was almost too easy. Yeah, you're not got too many attempts shorter than that one, and I don't think this was blocked. That's about as bad a miss as you can have. They will get four yards here on the first down run, and that'll make it second and six. Marcus Peters up to make the tackle. They'll come up second and six now from the 24. Second and six. Oh, we got Marcus Peters. Picked off by the Pro Bowler, Marcus Peters. He's had a fantastic rookie season, made a lot of lovely throws, but that wasn't one of them. But we gotta give him one, don't we? I mean, with the year he's having, a lot easier for he and his teammates to accept that throw, because for the most part, what they've seen what the is heck was that? The Lamar? The drive there is incomplete. He was wide. He so had nobody on that side of the court. Again, he could have possibly got some really good yardage. Maybe a touchdown. Jackson. Time to his what is going on? In there, but it's incomplete. The turnover put him in great field position. They don't want to squander it with third down coming up. No, not at all. And you know what else you do? You make your defense mad. Yeah. He got you the football, gave you a great opportunity. You got to catch. Got a man is caught for a Ravens touchdown. Hollywood, Marquise Brown. His second touchdown of the afternoon. Hey, well, and the Ravens Burn. turn that interception into a touchdown. And Charles, the defender, was there. He just didn't get it. Sometimes these plays turn into basketball in a sense. Two guys going up for the football. 
which guy's going to box the other away from it and grab it. Yeah, I know you hear it a lot, but it's just the will to get it, right? Oh, Can't without back, a doubt, the will, as well as a really nice touch on the ball that was thrown. And some talent, too. This is taken at the three. And nice work on the return as they start their drive just past the 30-yard line. The Titans offense set to begin the drive. And following the interception, just any interception, are you a little bit more cautious when you start that next drive, or no, you just throw that out the window? I think you are. I don't think that there's any way you can run back out there and go, ah, totally didn't affect me. Let's just go ahead and be loose with the football again. You're going to take care of it, but you have to be careful not being too cautious because now you can't run any offense at all. Still want to attack. We'll see how they attack him here. And he'll be upended at the 33 following a gain of three. And guess what? It brings up third down. This offense in desperate need of a conversion as they come up on third down. He dumps it off for Henry. Heck no. And he's going to be taken down. Dang, my guy is quick. Clearly short of the first by a few yards. Hits. So much about offense is what you call it. Oh, he ain't going to be put here, though. You know, you throw the ball to someone, they catch it, and then they can make a big play. You know, they create a play. Run right. after catch. They did a really nice job there of limiting that and keeping him from a first down. Yeah, stopped him in a second. Yeah, it like this. 12 yards on the return that time. Yeah. And the Ravens, they'll take over. The Ravens offense now. They get ready to head back on the field. And they're hoping to redo their efforts in the last drive. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just think of what right it's here. like now on the sideline. Because when you score a touchdown, you have to go up and look at the tablet and see what you did on the last drive. When you scored points, it's a whole lot better view than when you're trying to figure out how to fix things there. Now here's a pass on first down that's knocked away and incomplete. On second and ten. Run, 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 run. run. Going deep for Brown. Flag. Interference, baby. And it's going to wind up incomplete. However, we do have a flag down. Let's check in with our referee. This home crowd, they're happy with that call. <laughs> I like the way you said happy there, right? The so-called good guys didn't get a call. They feel like it's been that way all afternoon. You feeling their pain? They finally got one. Yes, they did. Now, here's a look for the end zone. But that one's going to wind up incomplete. Hollywood Brown, the intended receiver. That'll bring up second down. From the 34, they'll come to the line on second and 10. Miss Lamar. Being chased out left. And now he's I didn't use his the trucks. He turned that into a nice game. Gets him eight yards. I did not mean the down. Down. Third and two. Here's Jackson. Steps away to his left. He can run for it. And run. And he got it inside the 10 at the 8. Lamar Jackson, such a threat with those legs. Able to improvise and get the first. I found my goal line play, though. I just need to make it work out. Jackson. Flushed out right. He'll try and run it, and he's going to be brought down just shy of the five at the six. I need to learn how to make Give him a couple on the scramble. It's second down. The six-yard line, the line of scrimmage on second and goal. On second down, it's Hill. And it into the end zone for a Ravens touchdown. A six-yard touchdown run as the Ravens push for a second this is a team bye trying bye to face Titans. all year long. They did not win that division, that division. But they're putting it all in the game. Feels like a statement, back. doesn't it? An absolute statement game. A message to the top seeds. Oh, we're pretty darn good. Tucker now. They're taking away following the team.